Ladies and gentlemen, welcome uh, back to another Kinyo Mukbang. Today, we're eating a chicken soup, handcrafted none other by the chef, Danielle Victoria, also my wife. Uh, super healthy, you know, when you need a good, healthy start to the day. You know what I mean? Nothing better than the classic chicken soup. You see, we got a whole thing of corn in here. I'm tilting the bowl. That might not last much longer because it makes it a little awkward to eat. But we got corn, avocado, um, sour cream, uh, jalapenos. All right, well, let's go ahead and get in this. Oh yeah, thank you, Heavenly Father, for this food. Pray that you bless it, help it to nourish our bodies, help us to provide for those who do not have and bless the source from which you came. Amen. Chicken soup, you guys. Not really caldo though, right? Just a chicken soup? Yeah, it went left. <laughs> mm hmm. Mm. Wow. So good though, so hearty. I think the bowl tilting part of the show is <laughs> over. <laughs> Did that really add anything for you? I don't think so. I think it's the same thing. So let's keep it going. Mm. Thank you so much. Napkins. These are napkins. Alrighty. What am I drinking, you say? Okay, well, I am actually a little ashamed to admit it. Strawberry soda. I know you're thinking, what the heck? When did they start turning strawberries into soda? Yeah. I don't think that's really what's happening with strawberry soda. I think it's more of just a red liquid. But um, I don't usually drink soda. I've been staying off soda for a long time. I mean, every now and then I'll have a soda, I guess. But yeah, not not as an adult. You know, as a kid, I was definitely on soda. What's your favorite soda? Mm. Man, I love oh, cream soda. Right? Cream soda. Um, but if I was gonna go for some of the alt ones, you know, the cactus coolers. The squirts, surge. People don't know about surge. That was that was. Surge. Yeah, that's why they named them those. Because for thirteen-year-old, oh, yeah, twelve-year-old boys. Yeah, you see surge on the pants. Like, oh, I gotta mm. get, I gotta get this. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I was never a fan of the big red. I always thought that was just like a big thing. Big red, they just didn't go all the way. You know what I mean? I get it. I mean, it was a staple for some people, so let me not oh, even yeah, say that. I mean, it's a staple for whole communities. Yeah. So, I mean, I guess it's... This whole sandwich is just barbacoa and big red. Yeah, so I guess it's doing its job. They're like, yeah. It's not for you. You don't like it. Yeah, I think they brought back cactus school, or maybe it never went away, but... I didn't see cactus school when I was a kid. I thought that's not more as a couple. Hmm. But I think it's maybe like a West Coast. You know what I'd love? A refrigerator filled with every flavor of Fanta. Ooh, that's interesting. For that a party. Would, every but, flavor. That seems like it'd be fun for a party, but in real life, that'd be like, bro, we gotta get out the sugar. <laughs> I feel like they have like 80 different cans of like flavor, so it would just be like literally one that can. Is, that is right, because like, like, uh, like in different countries, they have like really cool flavors. Yeah. Like tropical flavors, like guava Fanta. Yeah. What are my other favorite sodas? Um, cream sodas, anything that has a cream soda in it, because sometimes they'll add cream. You know what I'm hoping for though? Like, there's favorite sodas and then there's dream sodas. I would love, um, and I've seen a couple people do it, caramel apple soda. Come on, come on guys. Mm. I feel like, even though I don't even know what this would mean, butter apple. I feel like, a, I feel like somebody's already did something. I don't even know what that is, but I want it. Cream apple. Yeah, because you could do kind of like Martinelli. What if you just mix Martinelli with cream soda? Mm. Would you like that? That would be amazing. Okay, yeah. Maybe you could try to do that. Yeah, I think that's kind of cool. Yeah. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Like 
Yeah. Yeah. Blue is kind of unnecessary. It is. It's not a flavor of anything. I guess it could be blueberry, but. Yeah. Like, Shoot. Blueberries can be a bit tame, honestly. Okay. I the most delicious of the berries. Blackberries? Blueberries. Oh. Blackberries are great. I think raspberries are great. Yeah, raspberries are amazing. Pink berries. Bye, she said bye another time. One way to know This is a whole different key for sure Is to never plan to look back at all These days, these hours of ours They're just gifts from above, my love I can feel me thinking of you, dancing like you do. That's the song Danielle right there. Back and forth again, my wife. It's not hard for me to imagine endless Summer and last dreams. All I ask is that you don't make this too hard for me. Diving in my memory. I just sang the whole song. Shouldn't feel like swimming back from Alaska. Ooh, yeah. <clears throat> you guys did not ask for that. You didn't ask for it. And I'm sorry that I was singing and eating. Mmm. Is your corn though? Is your corn? Certain vegetables are just weird. Corn is a weird vegetable. You can pop it, you can snack it. Whatever you can handle, you can hack it. Mm. Well, that's enough for me. Muy delicioso. Well, that was a corn implosion. All right, well, that's about it. Catch you loves later. Drop this video up there. Get AI to make a title for me. Run some hashtags. See if we can get this viewed by you. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And then share this. It's gotta be relevant to someone, you know?
So I just get the cartilage off that. This guy. I feel like in the future, someone's gonna watch this video and be like, wow. And that's 2023 for you. <laughs> be in the museum. Humans of 2023. Wow. Wow. Adios.